what's happened is the uh, the ewes spooked above us by 20 yards, and the rams, they were uh, over the headland to the right, to the north of the slopes. They were downhill about 400 yards, sleeping in the trees, and they noticed the ewes skyline running in the direction from us to the rams right now. So they did what smart rams do, and they got up, and they got up high, where they could use their eyes to advantage, because their uh, their ears don't really do much for them up here. So now they're just hanging out. They know they're in a safe place. Nothing can approach them without somebody seeing them, and they're uh, assessing the situation. And typically, the leader of that band of rams, the older one, he's going to make a decision what to do, and hopefully, he does it in our favor. We got wind at our back right now, but we're uh, quite a bit higher than them, so we're gonna sit here and wait for uh, the big the big ram to make the decision. And uh, I would definitely love to uh, harvest this big ram with a bow. I'm not about the tape measure, but uh, it's a mature ram, so and he's pretty heavy. So we'll see what happens.